नमस्कार आई एम डॉक्टर अमित भारद्वाज आई वेलकम यू ऑल फॉर इंडिया मेट्रोलॉजिकल डिपार्टमेंट डेली वेदर ब्रीफिंग फॉर फोर्थ नवंबर नाउ since the winter season is about to come so uh, we'll be issuing the minimum temperature statement and the fog conditions so if we uh, go for the uh, forecast for the fog so we have given the moderate to dense fog condition which are very likely over isolated pockets of our northeast of uttar pradesh on 4th and 5th november in the morning hours now if we talk about the realized rainfall condition so uh, tamil nadu one of the station re- received a uh, very heavy rainfall amount which is 12 cm and seven other station received the heavy rainfall amount if we talk about the kerala one of the station received 8 cm and south interior karnataka received 8 cm now if we talk about the observed minimum and maximum temperature departure as you know we are more focused to the development of the fog condition in the later period of the winter season mostly indo gangetic plain is very prone so the minimum and maximum temperature as you can see in this picture the left side is the minimum uh, temperature departure so minimum temperature departure are above normal 2 to 4 degree celsius over indo gangetic plain except north east uttar pradesh and bihar and where the normal temperature is about 3 to 5 degree celsius now if we talk about the maximum temperature as you can see in the right figure which are above normal by 2 to 3 de- degree celsius over indo gangetic plain uh, except bihar where the n- uh, near normal condition are prevailed so this is the past 24 hour observations now if we talk about today's highlight uh, so isolated uh, uh, heavy rainfall is likely over tamil nadu kerala or uh, today and uh, from 8th and 11th of november and no significant uh, weather in the rest part of the country uh, country but if we talk about the andaman sea so uh, first 3 days uh, heavy rainfall uh, over isolated location can occur now if we talk about uh, today's synoptic system so there is a cyclonic circulation which lies over north bangladesh and neighborhood area between 1.5 and 3.1 km above mean sea level we can also see that there is a cyclonic circulation over southeast arabian sea uh, and uh, which extend up to 3.1 km above mean sea level which also seen yesterday uh, uh, of south kerala coast but now it lies over southeast arabian sea now if we talk about uh, uh, the cyclonic circulation uh, a cyclonic circulation which is uh, developed today uh, lies over southeast bay of bengal which extend up to 3.1 km above mean sea level and from that cyclonic circulation there is a uh, trough runs from the cyclonic circulation over southeast bay of bengal to south tamil nadu which extend up to 3.1 km above mean sea level and tilted southward with height so these are the synoptic system so now if we talk about the 7 uh, day forecast you can see this in fi- picture this is day 1 to day 7 forecast has been given uh, in the graphical format so first three panel are the day 1 to uh, day 1 day 2 day 3 if we talk about the warning so uh, heavy rainfall warning has been issued for uh, extreme uh, peninsula of india including uh, isolated location over kerala tamil nadu uh, for day 1 also and uh, one nicobar island from day 1 to day 3 if you talk about the day one specifically for uh, thunderstorm warning south interior karnataka at titus isolated location thunderstorm warning has been issued and if you talk about the uh, fog condition day one and day two for uh, east uttar pradesh warning has been issued specifically for the northern side of it now day three uh, only andaman island has been issued the heavy rainfall warning so there day four there is no morning and day six onwards day six day seven day five day six and day seven extreme south peninsula of india specifically covering kerala tamil nadu south interior karnataka heavy rainfall warning has been issued due to the incoming system which has been developed over south in east bay of bengal which move uh, westward and uh, will cause mostly the activity in enhancing the northeast monsoon over these tamil nadu regions so these are the warning for 7 days uh, will uh, so these are the warning for today and you can actually get the updated information from imd website and you can follow us on twitter instagram and facebook so that's all for today namaskar dhanyawad